Hello everyone, my name is David Hunter and I'm the Sales Director for Terex Washing Systems. In this section of our Greenline webinar, I'm going to give you a brief walkthrough of the Terex AquaClear water management product offering and highlight the key steps in the process along with some of the features of our equipment. Firstly, all processed water from the TWS wash plant is collected in a sump. This sump can be located overground or underground depending on the site requirements. From the collection sump, dirty water is then pumped to the feed well of the thickener tank at a steady flow rate. As the dirty water is being pumped to the thickener tank, flocculant is dosed in line to facilitate effective mixing. The flocculant causes solid particles to bind together and settle to the bottom of the thickener tank where they form a concentrated sludge. The settling rate of the dirty water is continuously monitored automatically. This allows the system to adjust the amount of flocculant used and therefore optimise consumption. It's worth noting at this point that Terex offer both deep comb thickeners and flat rate thickeners to suit a range of different applications. Tank selection and sizing along with thickener technology selection will depend upon your specific requirements. The thickened sludge is transferred from the bottom of the thickener tank to the homogenizing tank where it is continuously mixed in order to prepare a consistent sludge. The sludge is then pumped from the homogenizing tank to the filter press where it is further processed to form solid filter cakes. The filtrate water is collected and returned to the dirty water collection sump at the beginning of the water management process. Recovered clean water wears over the top of the thickener tank into the clean water tank where it is stored ready to be reused in the TWS wash plant. Let's take a closer look at some of the AquaClear water management equipment. The homogenizing tank or buffer tank mixes the sludge to form a uniform consistency but can also provide additional storage capacity within the system. Terex offer a range of filter press housing options to protect the machine from the elements. However, they are not shown for the purposes of this animation. Other options available include core blow, robotic cloth washer and bomb doors. There are stainless steel sliding doors on the side of the filter press to provide additional protection and help keep team members safe on site. These are a unique feature of the Terex AquaClear product offering. The filter press operates via an electrohydraulic opening and closing system. High quality plates and subcomponents that are specifically designed for high pressure operation are used in the manufacture of Terex AquaClear filter press units. Thickened sludge is contained by high quality filter cloths and the filtrate water is expelled and then collected in stainless steel troughs that run along both sides of the filter press unit. The resultant filter cake contains up to 85% dry solids by weight at the end of the process. The AquaClear filter press is designed to open 15 plates at a time in order to discharge the filter cakes quickly and efficiently at the end of each cycle. Where the application requires, we can also provide lime dosing systems to help reduce cycle times on the AquaClear filter press. This concludes the section on AquaClear water management solutions, and I would like to pass you back to my colleague Paul McWilliams, who's going to talk about the new AgriSan 206 Green Line offering. But just before I do, I'm going to leave you with a few images of recent TWS AquaClear installations. Thank you.